Deputies were chasing three people who they say stole a car and took off towards DeSoto County. A DeSoto County deputy responded, found the car, and a fight ensued. And during that scuffle, the deputy's gun went off, but both sheriff's offices confirmed that nobody got hurt. Wink News anchor Annette Montgomery tells us what's next in this investigation. There's two separate investigations underway. The first one centers on the three people suspected of stealing a truck. The second must answer, how did a DeSoto deputy's gun go off? Monday morning, shortly after 7, Charlotte County dispatchers gave DeSoto County deputies a heads up. Three people in a stolen truck were headed their way. Just advise uh, DeSoto, it's a stolen Nissan truck, probably heading into their room. The stolen truck never got that far. The driver pulled into this parking lot along Duncan Road in Charlotte County. I don't know if they pulled in uh, as a sign of surrender or if they pulled in uh, maybe thinking they were going to be slick and the deputy would just drive right by. But the deputies didn't drive by. Both Charlotte and DeSoto County deputies went to talk to the three people in the truck. And that's when they decided they were going to fight and try to flee. The DeSoto County deputy's firearm did discharge during that scuffle. The gunshot didn't hurt anyone, but two of the suspects tried to use the confusion to escape. One of the individuals that fled was a skinny white female, brown hair. Second one was a Hispanic male, bushy hair, facial hair. The man and woman didn't get far. After all three suspects were in custody, detectives worked the scene, taking pictures and placing evidence markers on the ground. For neighbors in this small, quiet community like Maria Perez, the whole situation is alarming. Now I have to be more cautious of my surroundings because you don't know who's hiding behind that bush. As for the DeSoto County deputy whose gun went off, that deputy is still on the job. The DeSoto County Sheriff's Office told me that's because the gun went off accidentally and no one was hurt. In DeSoto County, Annette Montgomery, Wink News.